Hey, it's Jacob. Every day we bring you the best videos around and today we got the world's worst commute, a fourth grade fashion guru, and Snoop and Sai's hangover. Hangover, 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 hangover. Catch that chicken! The guy behind two of the 10 biggest videos ever on YouTube just dropped a new video. Hangover. For the new track, Hangover, Psy teamed up with the West Coast King Snoop D-O-double-G and their banger has been played more than 24 million times just since Sunday. Hey. Drink to your drunk, smoke like a broke stove, don't quit, take flight. I can't remember last night, it's I, this the life of a superstar, Psy. People are split on the true meaning of the song. It's obviously about drinking and party culture, but Psy's known for his deadpan social commentary, so what do you guys think? Is he celebrating excessive partying or poking fun at it? Party's over. It ain't over. That's not the only big music video today. British comedy duo Jack and Dean just put this out, and it is incredible in so many ways. This is a story about two individuals. Communication grew, they became a sort of ritual. One of them decided to change their mind. And just to clarify, that's completely fine. Because no means no. Yes, no. Yes, no. Yes, I get it now. It works only with your consent. These guys have been posting since 2008, and what makes it special is that it's more than just a funny music video. Yeah, it's a simple way to start a conversation about consent that everyone should be having. We really encourage you guys to share this. I just found a great job opportunity. The shifts last 15 days, the building often shakes violently, and the workplace is referred to as the hell of all hells. Also, this is the commute. This is a lighthouse keeper changing shifts with another worker on one of the several terrifying lighthouses off the northwest coast of France. This video actually posted last year, but it started trending this weekend on a bunch of blogs. Is your commute crazier than this? Post a link in the comments with proof. When you were nine years old, did you have a fashion blog and give TED Talks alongside cognitive scientists? Yeah, didn't think so. Meet Toby Odding, the most fashionable fourth grader around. The Boston Globe recently caught up with the aspiring tastemaker to learn more about him and his love of bow ties. So I started my blog a while ago, and because, you know, people were just telling me to start a blog. And I have different sections. I have eat, do, wear, see. I like to be an individual. I like to stand out in the crowd. I really found my voice through my blog and through my fashion design. He's so adorable. How does this video have less than a thousand views? Go share it. This week, the Pet Collective is out to prove that there's only one thing better than a cat in a wig, and that's a cat in a wig holding a giant butcher knife. Stay out of my kitchen! To celebrate the triumphant return of Orange is the New Black, these guys just posted what might be their best animal parody to date. My name is Piper Catman. I carried a bag of drug money once for an international smuggling ring. I really wish the bags weren't see-through. That's how I ended up here. Sentence nine lives. Dandelion, I brought you a flower. Thank you, crazy eyes. And now you my wife. Wait, do cats have wives? They've been killing it for the past two years with their pop culture reenactments and their, their endless videos of cats and bulls, but that's not all they do. Last week they posted this heartwarming piece about a dog who got a second chance at life. <laughs> new videos every day. Subscribe so you don't miss out on videos of puppies who don't understand stairs. <laughs> hey YouTube Nation, my name is John Wolf. Every Saturday I put up a video that is 15 seconds or less on my channel, Saturday Shorts. This week's video is a stop motion paper craft animation about Frankenstein's monster. Uh, uh. Thanks, John. You guys leave us a lot of great comments, so we wanted to take a moment to address a few. Joy Lofton asks, is that a kitchen I see in the background? Geez, what else do you guys have at YouTube Nation headquarters? Joy, not only do we have a kitchen, but we also have a pool, a dinosaur, and a full service deli. Mmm. Dethrone Me writes, I know nothing about the personalities who run YouTube Nation. I was wondering if you could dedicate a weekend for your profiles. Why wait until the weekend? Guys, go ahead, share your story. Thanks so much, guys. If you're aching for a little bit more info on Miles' failure as an MMA fighter, you might be in luck because 10 of our biggest fans are gonna get the chance to appear as a guest curator, be a part of exclusive Google Hangouts of me and the gang, and submit feedback directly to us. And if you're in the LA area, we got a couple of upcoming events that we'd love you to join. Check out the description for more info and then click the link to apply. Now play us out, Veer. Yeah.